Recently, my diesel particulate filter DPF light came on on this Audi A5. So let's switch it on and see if the light is still on. So I've just turned the engine on and uh, you should see the light appear at the top. And this normally happens when you drive the car um, primarily for short journeys, which it has been the case um, with this Audi A5. And to get rid of the light, what you need to do is that you need to drive the car um, at 2000 revs a minute for at least 10 minutes, uh, which is what I'm gonna do. Um, because obviously having a diesel car, the DPF um, tends to get clogged if you only use it for short journeys, hence the reason to do a longer journey at higher speeds every so often. So I've been traveling at 2000 revs now for about 20 or so minutes and the DPF light has come off and that's, that's all you need to do. I'm actually, um, this is an automatic, so to go over 2000 revs it's better to switch it to sports mode. So I've been traveling in sports mode now for, for quite a few minutes, 20, 30 minutes. And as you can see, there's no DPF light. So if you do have this issue with your DPF where the light comes on, the first thing you need to do is take the car out, um, drive it for over 2000 revs, and drive it for at least 10, 15 minutes, generally, or, or spend it to drive for more than that. Um, in my case, I've done it for about half an hour or so. So with a diesel engine, obviously, you need to take it out for a run every now and again. Uh, I would probably say two to three weeks as a minimum if you do drive it around town for most of the week. Hope you've learned something from this video. Hope you sort your DPF issues out. Please do subscribe, like and share, and I'll see you on the next video. Thank you.